Good morning, Bruce. Today is the first day or the opening day for state-owned enterprises G20 International Conference. Uh, this event will last for two days, uh, today on the 17th of October and also tomorrow on the 18th of October. Uh, today's event will start anytime soon and in, uh, for the opening, the Coordinating Minister of uh, Marine Affairs and Investment, Luhut Bin Sarpanjaitan, is set to open uh, the international conference. And not only him, I was also informed that the Vice President of Indonesia, Ma'ruf Amin, will also make an appearance. Uh, today's event is uh, attended by at least 500 of direct uh, attendee or participant and also 1,000 of uh, online participant. Uh, the aim of the conference itself uh, that w this uh, conference will discuss the role of state-owned enterprises in three priority agendas of G20 Indonesia's uh, presidency. Uh, that would include uh, healthcare, energy transition and also financial inclusion uh, by presenting national and also international speakers to the uh, panels which bring us to today's agenda. So today's agenda after the opening, uh, there will be uh, five panels for today. Uh, each panel will have different uh, theme uh, and the theme itself would be uh, around the uh, energy, about energy, about healthcare and also finance and also finance. Uh, but the first panel will feature the Minister of State and Enterprise himself, uh, Eric Tohir, and also the former uh, Prime Minister, uh, the United Kingdom Prime Minister, I mean, uh, Mr. Tony Blair. Uh, they, the discussion or the panel is entitled Role of Strong Corporate Governance and Global Cooperation for Sustainable and Inclusive Growth which is a big theme that is in line with the tagline for the G20 State-Owned Enterprises International Conference this year. Uh, it is entitled uh, Drive Sustainable, uh, Econ uh, sorry, Drive Sustainable and Inclusive Growth. So those would be uh, the main uh, focuses or the main issue for the conference. And uh, not only uh, panels, here at the conference you can also walk around the uh, expo room uh, that, will, that are filled with booths by several uh, state-owned enterprises companies such as PLN, Telkomsel, uh, Pertamina, Biofarma and more. And they, they are actually representing the transformation in four key pillars and they are sustainable tra uh, energy transition, healthcare transformation, digital ecosystem and also financial inclusion.